All right, guys. Today I'm gonna make you some scratch-made sausage gravy. This is uh, the first edition of Wild Game Wednesdays on the tugboat. I have some venison sausage that I had a processor in South Carolina make me, and uh, I'm gonna go through it real quick. It's very, very simple. There's only four ingredients. You got milk, well, five, sausage, salt, pepper, and all-purpose flour. There's no reason to make that gravy from the packet. Just follow this recipe, it'll be the best gravy you ever made. Starting out, we're gonna brown some sausage. This is an onion sausage. It's a flavor that the people in South Carolina make. Like I said, it's venison sausage. Push that all down. You wanna get a nice brown on it. Here's the trick. I'm gonna show you the right amount of flour to use for each cup of milk that you want. I'm gonna make four cups of gravy. That's your key, a heaping tablespoon. That's just how I do it. I've always done it that way. Um, it's the measurement. But because the venison is pretty lean, I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit of butter to this. And Turn my heat just down a little bit, and we're gonna go in with four heaping tablespoons of flour. Just like that. Then you're gonna stir and cook this down so you don't see the white anymore. I wish I had some bacon grease. Bacon grease would have been better than butter. We just didn't have any on hand. Now you have all the flour cooked, so to speak, so you don't see any white. I'm gonna start with two cups of whole milk. And you're gonna stir that as you bring the temp up. When it starts to bubble is when it'll thicken. Now I'm gonna add two more cups, but the last cup I'm gonna add slowly just to get the thickness how I want it. starting to get thick on me I'm gonna go ahead add in almost all of my milk but I'm gonna leave a little bit just so I can play with the thickness of the gravy it's a good time go ahead and add your salt in salt is gonna make your gravy not taste like paste so start with about that much don't be scared. And then black pepper, lots of black pepper makes for a good sausage gravy. You could add um, some red pepper flake if you like it spicy. I'm just waiting on my biscuits to be done. All right, so I've got my homemade from a bag biscuits and my actual homemade gravy over here. Like I said, you see it thickened up and a little bit of milk left. If it gets too thick, I could go back and thin it down some. But we'll get us a biscuit, split that thing in half like that. Might get two, I think. Ooh, they just came out stupid hot. Steep. Yeah. <laughs> then put you scoop of gravy on each one of those biscuits another one just for good luck and mm. how about that that'll stick to your ribs right ain't nobody's gonna want to do any work after this is it good charles oh, it's delicious it's hot but it's delicious <laughs> <laughs> This uh, edition of Wild Game Wednesdays was filmed in Guantanamo Bay, Cuba. See you on the next one.